up, dudes? And we're back here on some more Fake Blake Battles. Ooh, yeah. Today, my dudes, we're going to put Hello Kitty and her stamina with that Revolve Dash to the test against all of the Fafnir Beyblades. Are you ready for some epic battles? Ready. Then let's do it. Three, two, one, and three. Okay, my dudes, here we go. We've seen Hello Kitty in action. She went up against all of the Dynamite and uh, Ultimate Evolution Beyblades the other day. And holy moly, this Beyblade is actually phenomenal. It destroyed all the Valkyries. But that's why today I want to put it up against the Fat near Beyblades. Let's see if that Revolve Dash is actually as good as we all think it is. It's going to come down to that spin stealing abilities right now. Who is going to get the final spin? Yo! Hey, Yo! OP, bruh! Free two and every. All right, guys, holy moly. This is only the first evolution, but we've seen the first evolution of uh, Fafnir destroy plenty of new Beyblades. So maybe uh, Hello Kitty, or maybe it's just this Revolve. This is the whole reason why TT didn't want to give us a Dash version of Revolve. Because they knew it was too OP, bro. Like, holy moly. I love it. I love it. Top tier driver, man. Tournaments are going to be going crazy. All right, guys, here we go. Let's see if Hello Kitty can get that second point against Fafnir. And it did! Yo, yo, I love it! All right, guys, up next, go be guys. Let's do it. Three, two, one, and three. All right, my dudes, let's see if that Chosy Evolution, guys, Fafnir, can do better. Now, it does have a nice driver as well that moves around a little bit like uh, Revolve. A little bit more aggressive, though. Let's see if we can get that extra little bit of spins at the end like that Revolve driver does. So far, guys, uh, if you have got Hello Kitty, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't, do you regret not ordering it? Because holy moly, this Beyblade is an absolute beast. What? Three, two, and every. And again, guys, I'm actually in shock. Not gonna lie. Uh, I thought this would be a lot more uh, tougher, to be honest with you. Obviously, we know Hello Kitty is good. It's got a little bit more extra weight behind it than the first evolutions of Fafnir, so maybe that might be helping it get the extra little bit of spins, but we're gonna find out when we get to the other evolution. Oh! Did you guys just see that? What happened right there? It scraped and went down. That is one, one, three, two, and every. All right, my dudes, holy moly. Big attacks there by Fafnir, but at the same time, nearly losing control. Woo! One, one, this has probably been the toughest battle right now. I don't know if that was pure luck, what happened to Hello Kitty there, but the scrape literally just annihilated it. Let's see if Fafnir can do that again and regain its uh, spin-stealing master. Uh, oh, here we go, guys. Oh, Fafnir got that so close. You see, guys, Fafnir still is the king. Second evolution done. Now we're going over to that GT evolution. Let's do this. Three, two, and every. All right, guys. Oh! <laughs> These may be stamina Beyblades. Well, actually, technically, Hello Kitty is a balanced Beyblade. But, uh, yo, once you've got two Beys in the center of the stadium, the attacks are real. They're big. They're amazing <laughs> smash attacks. And, yo, let's see what's going to go down. So, guys, Fafnir was able to beat Hello Kitty. And, oh, another Fafnir gets it. Looks like once you get a little bit more weight on Fafnir, it knows how to beat these Beyblades. Oh! Three, two, and every. And here we go, guys. Honestly, I thought that Hello Kitty was doing insanely good at the start, and I was thinking, no way is it going to destroy all of these Fafnir Beyblades that quick. And uh, you know what? No. It was just uh, Fafnir. So it was, guys, free got mad. Free started to get angry. Look at that spin steal. Look at that spin steal. The master of spin stealing. The master of spin stealing. Can he get the win? <laughs> that, that's, that's why right here, Fafnir, your boy Free is the master. Master at spin stealing. That is what happens. All right, guys. Up next is that awesome Super King. Let's do it. Three, two, and every. All right, my dudes. You guys know we leave this uh, awesome Fafnir Beyblade in counter mode every time. Counter mode is just the best mode. Whether it goes up against right, left, it doesn't matter. Counter mode is the mode. I absolutely love it, man. You guys probably think, no, don't do that. But you know what, guys? I've proved it before. Counter mode just 
seems the ultimate mode for this Vafnir. All right, guys, here we go. Hello Kitty is actually getting put in his place. Like Freeze actually getting some revenge for Volk, because Volk couldn't do nothing against Hello Kitty. Oh, as soon as I said it, man, no way. All right, guys, uh, maybe maybe because it's in counter mode. What I'm going to do for you guys that are probably saying that, I'm actually going to flip this, right? Ooh, like this, so it's not going to be in counter mode as well. Let's see if that makes a difference. Three, two, one, eight, three. And now we're gonna find out if the counter mode stops it from winning. And uh, maybe I'll eat my words. <laughs> Let's see. Let's find out in this battle right now. The nice smash attack. The big hit that I'm seeing is absolutely epic. No knockouts just yet. No bursts. We're not really expecting any bursts out of these battles. To be very honest with you guys, but it's all about these stamina battles. The Witch Beyblade is actually going to get. Here we go, guys. Who's going to get? Oh, eat my words, Mr. LT. The counter mode did you not justice. And holy moly, it's 1-1. One, one. Free to on every. All right, my dude, it's 1-1. One, one. I left it in that mode. Okay? <laughs> I left it in that mode. There you go. Maybe counter mode, counter mode just spawned him. Maybe, maybe that's what I was just thinking. Oh, nice big hit right there by Hello Kitty. Maybe we can get a knockout and try and win. This is going to be it. This is going to be the battle that decides the winner of this uh, mini battle between these two. Let me go on to the final evolution of Vafnir. Here we go, guys. Let's see what's about to happen. Oh, get Hello it. Kitty, get it. And guess what, guys? Look, see, it's not in counter mode. So it was like a 50-50 chance. All right, guys. Up next is going to be the, the ultimate rubber. This is like just the all rubber round. You guys know this is the rubber of rubber Beyblades. Let's find out what this Vafnir can do. Free to your every. All right, my dudes, here we go. Now we're about to find out who is the best of the best with the, well, Hello Kitty's only got one evolution. Oh, oh Fafnir's got five. Let's find out if Hello Kitty can beat the final evolution. I think it's gonna be real tough because there's so much rubber, so much spin ceiling is gonna go on. It's definitely gonna come down to that drive. I think it's a kick drive. It's a kick drive. That's a kick driver on that Fafnir. Yeah, it's gonna come down to that one. Which driver is the best for the spin that's stealing right at the end? It's gonna be very close, guys. So if I get any of these wrong, just let us know in the comments below. But here we go. Fafnir, Fafnir yeah. just stole that. Free two on every. All right, guys. Here, ooh, woo, big hit, nice attack. All right, Fafnir just got that. That's how close these battles are, guys. Literally, every time you face a Fafnir Beyblade, that's how close they are. All right, here we go. It's gonna come down to them tiny spins once again. Let's find out if Fafnir can do it, or if this time maybe Hello Kitty can just get a little spin to take the win from Fafnir. All right, guys, check this out. It's definitely gonna be close. Make sure you keep your eyes. No, it's not gonna be close. All right, so what we're gonna do now, guys, is we haven't actually put Hello Kitty into left spin before. So we're gonna put this in the left spin and do a couple more rounds. Three, two, one, every. All right, my dudes, here we go. Both Beyblades in left spin mode. Now Fafnir definitely falls to other Beyblades in the right spin or the left spin. Uh, let's find out right now. It's gonna be the same with Hello Kitty because there's gonna be no spin ceiling here. It's just gonna come down to which Beyblade is the best. And it looks like Hello Kitty might actually get her revenge. And she does. Free to an every. And guys, this is Fafnir's last chance to get, ooh, he's doing that uh, Ragnarok special move right there. Holy moly, that move scares me. Every single time it goes, it goes down and up, and sometimes it throws itself out of the pocket. I hate when it self uh, KOs itself, man. I do not like that, man. All right, here we go, guys. Come on, Fafnir, you can do it. Keep it alive. Yes, 1-1. One, one. Three, two, one, every. All right, guys, this is definitely the last round right now. 1-1, one, one, very, very intense battle going down. Holy moly. Woo, that little bit extra speed right there. I like it. All right, here we go. This is what Fafnir needs to do. Get them attack slow down, Hello Kitty, to get the win. It's going to be close. Which Beyblade is going to do it? Hello Hi, Kitty, Kitty, right at the end. That cool it looks when it spins in left as well. That's pretty awesome, man. All right, guys, definitely probably the hardest matches that Hello Kitty Beyblade has had so far out of all the battles we've done. If we should put up against any other Beyblades, let us know in the comments below do you think we should go stamina 
defense, maybe more attacking. Let me know what Beyblades and Evolution we should put up against Hello Kitty next. And maybe we should go left or right. Let me know all that stuff in the comments below. But until then, we'll see, see you in the next, next episode. Do Jeff!